EastEnders' latest update. Hunk who played Josh Hemmings unrecognizable with longer hair and beard five years after BBC soap exit. Vicky Michelle discusses real-life friendship with on-screen love rival. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. EastEnders hunk who played Josh Hemmings unrecognizable with longer hair and beard five years after BBC soap exit. It's been five years since Eddie Ear bowed out of the BBC One soap, and he now looks completely different. EastEnders fans will remember Eddie Ear as Walford hunk Josh Hemmings and the controversial storylines that surrounded the character. But five years after his soap exit, the actor looks very different. As the youngest son of villain James Wilmot Brown, William Boyd, Josh was never destined to be a man of innocence and integrity, given the apple never falls too far from the tree in Albert Square. Josh arrived in Walford in 2017 and wasted no time in sparking a romance with Lauren Branning, Jacqueline Jossa, despite already being engaged. After Josh plays a part in planning to develop Albert Square into luxury apartments, known as Project Dagmar, he questions his dad James' controlling behavior and quits his job at their family business. He decides to take a lucrative job offer in Scotland only after one year in the East End and Lauren had promised to leave Walford and go with him, but at the crucial moment, she changed her mind. Since leaving EastEnders, the 34-year-old soap star has continued to act on stage and screen, and last year he starred as Steve Hodges in Doctors and played a role in The Walk-In. Most recently, he played Joe Bloom in Father Brown and has also starred in The Athena, Ransom, and Cursed. Although Game of Thrones fans will recognize Eddie as Gerald Hightower from an episode in 2016, a year before he landed his EastEnders role. Eddie will reprise his role as Hightower as part of the HBO Max spin-off series House of Dragon. EastEnders star Vicky Michelle discusses real-life friendship with on-screen love rival. Michelle is back on the square as Rocky Cotton's wife, Joe. EastEnders star Vicky Michelle has opened up about her real-life friendship with on-screen love rival Gillian Tailforth. Michelle is returning to the square as Rocky Cotton's wife, Joe, causing trouble for Tailforth's character Kathy, who is engaged to Rocky. But while their love rivals on screen, in real life Michelle and Tailforth have known each other forever. Speaking about their relationship, Michelle said, We support several of the same charities, so we see each other reasonably regularly, so we were friends beforehand. That's really good as it allows us to work off each other. Before I say one of Joe's fabulously wicked one-liners, I say, sorry Gilly, I've got to be really vile to you now, and she says, don't worry, so do I. Michelle also opened up about whether she thinks Joe has any actual feelings for Rocky or if she's just out for revenge. I think when you love someone you don't ever stop, but that love can turn to hate, Michelle said. So I think she probably hates him, but in a way still loves him because he was the love of her life. For all of those years when Rocky was missing, Joe didn't know whether he was dead or alive, so she's held a candle for him believing he's passed away. But that's changed now, she's found out that he's still alive. So when she sees him again, even though it's 25 years later, She's still got those feelings, and the hurt he caused her over all those years makes her really want revenge. Joe will return to Walford this week with divorce papers for Rocky, and, according to Michelle, she's ready to stir up some serious drama. She wants to come back and create some animosity, Michelle said. She's loving seeing Rocky squirm. Every time he sees her, he feels threatened by her. He loves Kathy, but Joe is the spanner in the works. Joe is obviously gloating because Rocky thinks he's got signed divorce papers, but has he? There lies the question. And so if he marries Kathy, is it legal? She's there to really stir it up because he broke her heart 25 years ago. She was so in love with him, and I think when she sees him now, 
She's still in love with him, and she wants to hurt him because of how much he's hurt her. She's quite hard now, and I think she's really hardened to men in general because of Rocky, so she really wants to stir it up, and she's out for vengeance. Thanks for watching these videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.